Hey, it's Dr. Lowenstein, um, and uh, I got a bunch of questions over the weekend to answer, so we're doing some videos answering those, and um, Christine uh, asks, do you perform surgery for out-of-state patients, and if so, how long is the recovery, and how do you manage that process? Which is a great question, because actually, um, many of our patients, if not most of our patients, actually travel to see us, just because there's not a lot of people who do migraine surgery, and um, so uh, I've got people from all over the country that, that, that come for this. Um, and so it's a very routine situation that, that we do a lot. Uh, we do phone um, or Skype or <clears throat> FaceTime consultations um, so patients know what to expect. And I can generally screen to make sure that they're good candidates because it's a long trip to make if, if you're not a good candidate. Um, you come in, I do some injections make sure that we're doing the right thing and making sure that we have nerves to address. Um, a day or two later, we do the operation and then I see the day after surgery. And I like people to be in town for at, at least three days, but a week would be, a week is ideal. Um, but you come back in a couple of days later just to make sure that everything is, uh, all your questions are answered and everything's looking good. Um, but it's mostly, honestly, out of, for, for patient consideration, for patients to get any questions that they have answered so they're, they're confident in what's going on. And then they go home. Um, and I say, look, if you're ever in Santa Barbara, I'd, I'd love to see you again. Um, but we do the rest of the follow-ups either uh, by phone or um, in another office. So we have offices uh, in Denver and we have offices in Santa Barbara. And if it's easy for pay, pay patients to get to one or the other of those offices to do an in-person in -person, follow-up, then that's, that's great. Uh, if it's not, um, you know, it's, it's not unusual for me to operate on somebody uh, and do, you know, see them right after surgery for the next couple days and then do the rest of the follow-ups uh, by phone. Um, so, uh, yes, we do operate on people from out of state, uh, and in fact, uh, many people uh, from, from out of state. And um, we have a very streamlined uh, process where uh, patient coordinators are very helpful in getting people um, help with places to stay here and you know things to do for their family uh, when they're here and trying to make it as pleasant an experience for everyone as possible. All right, hope that helps. Um, keep asking the questions and uh, I appreciate it. All right, take care.